Hello everyone, welcome to our Let's Play series of Dragon Age Origins. This is Colonel RPG as usual, and I'm very happy that it shows to join me today as we do research. We're doing uh, research. We're reading books, and uh, we're learning about the elves. Let's see what this one says. Uh, which book would you like? The first one. This book details the construction and usage of folk talismans from ancient Tevinter. Okay. This book is mainly a dry treatise on chasen superstitions. This book is written in an ancient dialect and you cannot read it. I recognize it. the character on this page. I think it makes up part of the word Illuvian. Uh, is, is this like the book you lost? Similar. The bindings are in the same style, but the script is different. This is a library, isn't it? Perhaps another book could help us translate this. Oh. I think we have indeed found the way to do it, then. I know where the translate. Well, I think I know where the translation is. Let's see. Translating elven languages in the history section. History section? It's not here. So then that little index actually... Yeah, it's over there. Uh, that little index actually starts becoming a, re a relevant thing rather than just us being able to do everything by going through all the bookshelves. Uh, translate Elven languages. This should help you translate the Elven text. Uh, you found a volume that can help you translate the text on Elven relics. Yes? I have a good feeling about this. It's good. Um, also, the quest marker is showing us where to go. Wait, we didn't take the book? I really thought we were going to take the book. Because we're, we took the translation one. Uh, is this one on the relics? Yes. Using the translation book, you locate a chapter on Illuvian. Whoa, who let a dog in here? And what are you doing? Be careful! You're in my light. You look... Uh... Like you could probably squash me like a gnat, but I can't sit by while you mishandle innocent tomes. You, you're bending the book too much. It'll, it'll crack the spine and cause the pages to fall out. Just thinking about it is making me dizzy. Are you familiar with this book? I've used it, but I don't know it by heart. Hmm. Browsing the chapter on the Illuvians. No one's actually found one, you know. You know what Illuvian is? It's old elvish for seeing glass. Mirror. Like the Palantirs, most likely. No, not mirror, actually. That wouldn't be, uh, it, it, you know, no, nobody has ever found a mirror in, you know. Um, uh, it just, it, this game takes a lot, uh, takes after <laughs> Lord of the Rings so much that, uh, that I thought it might have been a Palantir. Palantir, if you don't know what it is, it's from Lord of the Rings. Um, it shows up in the movie, I think only... Briefly in the uh, cinema edition, but if you have the extended edition, especially of the second one, you you get to no. It shows it shows up more than briefly. It shows a couple of times in the second movie, um, but uh, but yeah, it's basically like a crystal ball that you can see far away, or basically you can communicate with other crystal balls. But it, it, the point is, it's a seeing glass, not a looking glass, which is a mirror, I think, unless I'm mistaken on that. It's old words, you know how it is. Uh, your keeper couldn't even translate the word for mirror? It's a 2,000-year-old dialect. She's right. The word is from the lost language of Arlathan, forgotten over eons of slavery. I only know a few dozen words of it, and I'm the Circle's linguist. The Luvian isn't just any mirror. It's a special kind. When the Imperium sacked Arlathan, they took these mirrors and tried to unlock their power. But all they could use them for was communication over long distances. Like Palantirs. Actually, the pluralization of Palantir might not buy, might not be with an S. I don't know how the the elves do it, because Palantir is an el uh, an elven word in the Lord of the Rings. Um, why would Morgan be interested in that? Ah, you have a friend with a special interest. Maybe she needs to talk to someone. <laughs> hmm. My people crossed paths with another Dalish clan not too long ago. Two of their young hunters encountered a strange mirror in some ruins. One disappeared, the other became deathly ill. They never found the one, and the other died. They left Ferelden and traveled north to forget their sorrows. 
So these mirrors are dangerous? I've never read anything about the Illuvians making people ill. But what became of the mirror? Shattered. Destroyed. <gasps> Why? It was corrupted by the Darkspawn. Beyond hope of recovery. They did it to protect others. Even broken, it could be used to find the others. No, don't get ahead of yourself, Finn. You have to be sure. What? What do you know? This is so exciting. We have to get to the repository. Hadley has the key. Come on. <laughs> and he immediately cast the spell. <laughs> uh, well, I guess he barged himself into the into the team. Uh, sure, sure, sure thing. Do you not have the blades of the you do? There you go. Let's level you up. He is a spirit healer, so off to a good start. Uh, minor health, regeneration, extra magic, mental resistance, extra magic, constitution and spell power. Uh, actually, blood mage is probably the best thing. Uh, we got keeper over here. Um, we can mess with it and see what it is. No living thing can escape the cycle of life. All who fall return to the earth. The mage now regains some health whenever a keeper's spell inflicts damage. And nature's vent. Eh, it's not really what I'm looking for. Let's go with the battle mage over here. A draining aura. <clears throat> Hand of winter. Wait, what? Hand of winter. Does it freeze? No, it just slows them down. This restores mana whenever the mage suffers damage, which is interesting. Uh, that's that's not bad at all. This thing adds magic. I kind of want the spell power. Yeah, I'll go with Blood Mage, most likely. Yeah, let's go with that. Um, so he's got five points there. I want to make him... Well, yeah. Yeah. I mean, right? Yeah. So I'll go with the Cone of Cold, obviously. Uh, we got some things over here. Are these new? Are these new for this DLC, I wonder? Got some entropy over there. That's good that you have the Mind Blast. That actually works quite uh, well. Uh, we have a Blizzard that I don't really need. We have Draining Aura. Uh, and uh, I'll go up on that. And maybe even this. The Battle Mage creates a field of chaotic, swirling energy that, that continuously arm near harms nearby enemies with da with damage from each of the elements in turn. As long as this spell is active, the spell consumes mana rapidly. Mm, yeah, I'm not a big fan of that, then. Uh, Fade Shield. The Mage alters the Arcane Shield. Uh, oh, wait. Alters? Adding? Oh, he just adds. Okay, that's good enough. And we got the Blood Mage up here. The, that's fine with me. Do you actually have the shield up? We don't. So go right ahead and I'll worry about your spells eventually. We're, we're good to go. So... Wait, we're just leaving? You translated the elven text and met a mage, Finn, who told you that Illuvian is an ancient elven word for mirror. He's sure something in the repository could help more. Yeah, let's have a chat with all of you, in fact. So, Bellum? Let's go talk to Hadley. I'm sure we can chat later. Uh, uh, well, I guess that's that. To Adley. I don't think we're going the right direction. Mm, no, we're not. There's a marker. But the arrow is so very tenuous over there. And <laughs> Look, I didn't... Finn, he fetched me a flower. <coughs> oh, how thoughtful. It's very pretty. Slobbery, but pretty. I don't know where Bellum got a flower. The so. Morgan would save us a lot of trouble. Uh, I missed that line over there. You're gonna need to pause to see what that is. Uh, hey, Hadley. Hadley? Whatever. Hi. Hadley! Just the man I was looking for. Not looking very hard, were you? I'm always here. <laughs> Good one. So I, um, I need to go into the repository. No. No? Why not? I'm not some drooling apprentice. It's because of me, isn't it? No. The Sentinels have been behaving erratically, so the repository is locked for everyone's safety. Oh. Well then. Uh, sorry for bothering you. You're giving up just like that? Well, look at the way he's staring at me. Just give us the key. I can look after myself. Oh. Very well. It's your necks. 
But before you go, what's so important down there? The statue. It knows things about Tavinta, and I need to speak to it. All right. Be careful, and keep the mess to a minimum. You know that talking to inanimate objects is a sign of insanity. Not when it talks back. You think the statue talks to you? It's complicated. It wasn't always a statue. You'll see. It's actually a good point. Not when it talks back. That's, uh... That's the basis of human communication, right there. Like me, for example, who am currently talking at an inanimate object. Um, so, yeah. Human communication, yay. Also cell phones and, you know, other things. So what are we in for? A big room down there. Me clicking, uh, trying to use the wrong key. Wait, what? Wrong key for sure. Uh, let's go this way. Because the quest marker is over there. Also, this way doesn't go anywhere. So, yay for being uh, correct, I suppose. Uh, corrupted Sentinel. Why are you corrupted? Also, why am I not attacking? I hate this pathfinding. Seriously, it's weird. I don't, I don't get it. Okay, that's a stun. And now you. That's a resist. So, let's try and do a flicker or whatever. And uh, try to do some good things in here. Wait a minute, what is that? A veil tear. Yeah, you, we probably should focus on this. Backstab the veil tear. That's how it works. That's good. It's good. It's good. going back to normal. We need to deal with the rest of the rips in the veil if we can. Oh, I guess I you answered my question then. Why are they corrupted? Because they they. Because we didn't backstab the Veil Tear all that well. Uh, we got a bunch of... Double Baked Mabari Crunch. I need to figure that out. This used to be where the phylacteries of the apprentices were stored. They've been moved to a more secure location. We don't even know where they are anymore. That's not very secure then, I suppose. Or maybe it is. I was just jumping off the staircase, forgetting what kind of game this is for a brief moment. Hmm. There's red rain, or whatever that is. The prison is breached. I see the encroaching darkness. Wow. It does talk. Uh, hello? The, the shadow will consume all. It seems afraid. Something is causing it distress. The tears in the veil, most likely. The statue's useless until we mend the veil. Unless it attacks us. Wouldn't surprise me. Okay, we need to mend the veil then. By stabbing it in the back. A landmark device. Yes! Your hound seems particularly interested in this landmark. Does he? Because I can't do anything about that. Remind me not to step in that. My body dominance is now active. Ah. So that's what those are for. Well, I guess I didn't miss anything by not huh. coming back with my, with Bellum before in the previous in the previous areas where that happened. Okay. Um. You know what? I'm gonna get my spellcaster on. No, that's not a spellcaster. Because spellcasting is where it's at. Oh my god, the Mabari is just going in on these guys. Uh, where's the... the I, there's the skill that I want and need forever. Uh, and here's where we are. Okay, and then you do good things here. Do a uh, an ending flurry. Or whatever it's called. That worked out quite all right. Is this wise? Someone could die. Are you gonna say that every time? Cause that is a. Re Did they look at me just then? They do look at me. You creeps. My God. Uh. Okay. Well. Here goes more spell casting. Oh, that's. What are you doing? Okay. Uh, I need to position myself, and that's why I'm being so brave in here. Okay. 
should be fine right there. And then you can go over here and I can look for... What? Is that what I'm looking for? Oh no, we need to kill them a little bit before things work. Murder, murder, murder. Okay, we have some good things in here. Uh, I think. Is it working? I don't think it is. You're not doing enough damage. Uh, whoa, really? Did we not kill it? Did it just disappear? Oh my god, yeah. Whoa, 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 whoa. Let's deactivate another system. Yeah, that seems to make the weak spot move. It's that seems Hmm. Yeah, this one is uh I think it was meant to um It was meant to show us this mechanic. That we need to kill the deactivate. Lovely. We need to kill the sentinels so that the veil shows up. So focusing damage is where uh, is what we really need. Cause that's how we um this how they show that's how they show up. Speaking of which there's a freaking spell cast in the back. Okay. Oh, that's actually a bit of a problem. I'll try my best. The veil has just appeared. Good, good, good. Let's do this and be quick about it. Let's bring you around. Uh, that is not the back, but let's... Oh my god, you're turning, aren't you? That's not a problem. I'm just gonna be... Okay. Come on, bring it down. Okay, it didn't... wasn't brought down. Uh, so everybody attack here. And please do attack. Don't be weird with your AI, because I know you like to be. Shouldn't we have had a veil already? Because I am done with these fireballs. No veil, apparently. Uh, well, we do have a healer, though, so it's not the be that big of a deal. Uh, you didn't use that. Oh, there it is. We found it. Help me! Oh, it's gone. Holy crap. Yeah, kill the spellcaster. Where is it? it? Just takes forever to show up. There you are. Okay, so he doesn't move. That, mu that much is good. Because I thought he might, like, rotate. Yeah, we didn't kill it. We also didn't have momentum on. No, we did it. We killed it. Oh, that worked out. And this leads onwards. I don't know where these guys are going. Let's go to this room first. That definitely doesn't have an enemy in it. It just has seven gold. Seven and a half, to be precise. And now onwards. Do I just go around a little bit? Yep. I mean, we're supposed to disable disable all the, the veil tears, so it makes sense. Can you please don't not do what you just did? Good enough. Veil tear shows up. Ah. Oh. oh, piece of junk. I hate you. And I think veil tear of course goes away. Okay, you do your thing. I think it's just showed up. That's... Stunned for days. My god. Let's try and bring you down. Stunned for days again? Or did something... Nope. It, it was not stunned for days. Okay. So you do that and then do this. I could swear I killed one of these in a single blow... In a single flow. But I think I must have killed somebody at the same time. Like, while I was killing the veil, somebody killed. Yeah. That must have been what happened. You 
Look at that. Even the spellcaster goes away. Good job. It's a bit of a mess for a fight, but it works. Because, you know, you're fighting a lot and not yes. necessarily killing anything. It's pretty gimmicky, but it works. What do we have? I'm off. A Paragon Hail Rune for 35 physical resistance. That scares me a little bit. Speaking of scaring, um, we have a new mage, which means I can use the things that I have. Uh, let's see. Extra willpower, chance to avoid. Yeah, that's pretty good. Uh, you also need a hat. Uh, mana regeneration in combat, armor and magic. Whew, that Vestments of the Seer is amazing. Uh, we got chance to dodge attacks. We got a bunch of... Yeah, I actually prefer those. Uh, these are specifically for uh, made for him, though. Finn... Uh, for, so it's, it's for Finn, but uh, fur-lined boots. And then we have this. Which has extra spell... But yeah, it's just better than his current one. His current one is called Vera, which means... Uh, truth, I think? Or true in Latin. Mm, I don't actually know. Don't remember. Uh, I don't like the spellcaster. Didn't paralyze me, so I like that spellcaster. Oh, this guy turning... Oh, yeah. Turned his back on me pretty fast. Okay, so... Don't have the momentum. Please activate the freaking momentum. Why do I... Why do you disable it? I think I know why. It's it's just the uh, the endurance running out. Thanks, that was so lovely and jolly. I like that a lot. Oh, I, how I enjoy the pleasure in my skin that is being blasted in the face by a fireball. Okay, um, don't attack that one. Attack that one. Okay, good. Where is it showing up? On the other side of the country. Okay, uh, I might be able to do this, though. It's a teleport. I think it is faster. Yeah, we did it. We didn't do it? No, we did. That one wasn't... Also, Ariane, can you please stop being paralyzed? That was a little bit worrying for a little bit, but that thing takes... That's even worse than the archers, my god. Uh, we got a couple of runes over there that are beginning to worry me, because there's a lot of them. And uh, I don't have inventory space. I should have easily ten times what I have. Uh, but I've already made the case for having infinite uh, in in inventory weight, so or inventory space, I should say. It's not really the weight, it's more the number of items, which is even more ridiculous. Then no wait. Fight. I'm off. Shoot! You have to give him something. You can't just say fetch and expect him to retrieve random things. Why not? Once heard of someone with a really smart Mabari who would run off and fetch things like... Like cake. I think this one's broken. This one is broken. It's true. You don't fetch cake. You're broken. Who? What kind of Mabari doesn't fetch cake? Like, seriously. S SMH. Where are you going? What? We need to talk to the statue. Dude, like, what do you expect? Don't worry. The statue is right here. Hi, I did the thing. I am the spirit of Eleni Zenovia, once consort and... Advisor to Archon Valerius, blah, blah, fall of the house. Yes, yes, we've been through that. Finn, greetings. Finn, uh, you, you two have a close relationship? We've conversed before, on the Imperium. It's hard to get answers out of it. Requires passing all the grandiose mumbo-jumbo. We know where a broken Illuvian lies. Can it still be used to find the others? Scry, the broken glass, dagger sharp, will be your key. Scry? The lights of Arlathan will illuminate the Scryer's path. The Archons possessed them, but they were misused, befouled, and lost, like so much the Imperium touched. Some were saved, carried by fugitives from the Elven city. Their sorrow awoke the stone, 
and her children sheltered them. They found a sanctuary in the deep halls of Kad Halash, now known as Kadash. There the lights of Arlathan lie, shielded from unworthy eyes. Hmm. Kadash Thaig. Impossible. That's. It's not that old. So you know of it. Convenient. Goodbye, Finn. We will not speak again. What? What's that supposed to mean? It's supposed to mean that we are out of time for the day. So for right now, I'm Colonel RPG, and this has been Dragon Age Origins. I really hope you've enjoyed it. And if you did, go ahead and leave a comment. Like the video if you want to see the next episode come out sooner rather than later. But above all, thank you so much for watching. And I hope I'll see you next episode. Bye-bye. I can't, I can't, I can't do the... There we go.